After the loss of my hardcore Iron Man status, a new adventure is born. Carrying on from where I left off, without the fear of death looming overhead, there's no holding back. This is Dead Smithy, and welcome to my Iron Man progression series. Okay, so we're kicking off the episode with a hard casket. Um, I know I said last episode that we're going to start stocking up caskets, and you guys in the comments have said, yeah, I think that's a good idea. For hard clues, I think until we get a blessed dehyde body, uh, I'm going to just keep opening them. But for beginners, easies, mediums, etc, etc, we're going to start stocking them up. But with that being said, can we kick off the episode with some decent RNG? No, no we can't, it's just a load of alcohols. I mean, yeah, cool, money, but uh, no no blessed dehyde there, no blessed dehyde, anyway. Gaming. Alright, so we're currently in the City of Dreams, aka Falador, I mean, it's, it's Falador. Uh, and we have 2.7k Stardust, which means that if I speak to this chap here, uh, I can spam through all of this bollocks. Uh, can we trade? He's going to be like, yeah, go on then. And I'm going to buy myself a Celestial Wing. R wing? Ring. There you go. Uh, I don't know how much a star, a star Fragment's 3k. But anyway, we can now use these Stardust on there. I'm going to put them all in, just because bowling. Uh, and that gives us a, I think it's a plus three? Uh, plus four uh, Invisible Mining Boost, which is rather nice. Uh, not that I'm doing any mining at the moment, but I uh, was mining some uh, sandstone for crafting and uh, one of the shooting stars landed there uh, while I was mining so I thought I'd mine it because I was pretty close to uh, getting enough uh, fragments but uh, yeah we've now got the celestial ring and you, know, you just check it and see what charges you got but that's really nice to get because uh, I am planning on doing quite a bit of mining soon because uh, mining is definitely one that I want to get up to the uh, around the 80s to start doing some actual decent fletching with well, once I then get the smithing up, but you, you get what I mean. And there we go, there is another level coming in. Well, first of the episode, which is 79 crafting. Uh, I don't know if that gives us anything. Black uh, Dragon Hired Van Braces, which is rather nice. I think we've got quite a few, um, uh, what are they called? Hides. Yeah, there we go, hides uh, in the bank. So we could use those to go towards the uh, crafting grind. Uh, but I prefer to save them for, you know, later on when we get chaps and bodies. Um, but yeah, just... You know, making some unpowered orbs while watching West Ham tear up the Premier League, mate. You know what I mean? Uh, but yeah, all, all jokes aside, that's really nice that we're, uh, you know, progressing towards 80. Um, we're now on one point, nearly 1.8 million XP in it as well. Um, I'd love to get crafting to 99, but you know, that's that's a pipe dream, my boys. That's a pipe dream. Um, but yeah, we do indeed be gaming. Also, uh, I'm now on the new PC. Um I've had some issues with getting all my software set up and all my streaming stuff. Um, but yeah, I, this is not the first clip. I mean, all the clips that you've seen in, so far in this episode have been on the new PC. But uh, yeah, we're now on the new PC, boys. So we, we're gaming even more. Woohoo! Look at him go! Right, there we go. There is the first Zora KC of the episode. And we're getting some, ooh, some coal. Steady on. Uh, some death runes and some Zora scales. Pretty slow kill. But um, hey-ho, we got it anyway. Uh, but yeah. Not bad, not bad. Uh, the, the servers have stopped lagging, so I can do PVM again. Well, hey! Right, there we go. This is the second KC, and we're going to get adamant bars, mahogany logs, and some more scales. Interesting loop, that one. <laughs> hey, there we go. I think that's probably our quickest kill yet, right? Yeah, there we go. Um, oh, bang on. Bang on the uh, the KC. Or the, the time, sorry. Um, yeah, I just about got it in the second rotate. Oh, just about nearly... You know, got it in the second rotation there. Um, I've also been using a range pot to pot up a little bit just before we go in. And um, for that, we've got some Zolra scales, some Runite ore, and some more teleports, which are rather nice. But uh, yeah, you know, I'm really happy with that. I can feel our sales progressing. Right, there we go. There is 57, 56, and we get in uh, flax. More bloody palm trees, lads, and some scales as always. But uh, yeah. Not as quick as last time, but we're getting that time slowly down. Decent. Right, and there we go. There is 57kc now. Anything? Death runes. A rune spear. Pretty sure that's rare drop table, but oh well. And uh, scales, obviously. <laughs> Look at this weapon. <laughs> but uh, 349, not bad. Not bad, I guess. But uh, yeah. Decent. Right, there we go. There is a real clutch up kill. Fucking hell. And we get... Some lovely pure essence, death runes, and some scales. Oh, baby. A five-minute kill as well. Crikey. 
Right, there we go. There is another KC. I think that's 59. Yeah, it is. Toad Flax. Yikes. Uh, flax. Yikes. Scales. Meh. Uh, I need to go and get myself some more cosmic runes to come actually out. So um, we're going to take a little break from Zora. And I'm going to go and do some rune crafting. Ooh, steady on. Ooh! Ooh! Ooh, that's a unique! Big harpoon fish! Hello! Oh, and seven pages. Wow. Look at that. Big harpoon fish. There's one for the collection log, boys. I think you stuff it and you stick it on a wall in your house. But I think I've, that's where I've got the big shark. So that's going to live in my bank rotting, I think. But uh, no, nah, it's nice to get a unique. I've kind of gone... Uh, I say dry. I haven't gone dry here. Uh, last thing I got was the barrel. Um, and, well, I guess finishing off the set as well. Where are we? Uh, what's his name? Temporos. Um, there we go. So got the big fish. Big fish, little fish, cardboard box, but we haven't got the tackle box, and that's the only box we want in my life. Uh, no pet, but let's face it, I don't even know what the drop rate of that is, but uh, unique, baby! Okay, so I'm doing the Hazel Cult quest because I thought I'd knock off some of the uh, novice ones. I kind of completed it. Uh, I think I've still got something to finish. I, I didn't really read it, and I hit record, so uh, now we've got this kind of awkward recording. Uh, what do I do? Open this... Search. Is that it? Is that it? Please be it. There we go. All right, there it is. <laughs> there is quest complete. We get one quest point, 1.5k thieving and 2k coins. We're up to 219 quest points. Uh, I was going to do Swan Song, but I've got to do Garden of Tranquility, and that just sounds like a complete pain in the ass. A whole quest around farming. Who came up with that? Like, who who sat down and went, you know what? Let's make a farming quest. No, we didn't need that. Don't do... No, but I do need to do it for um, Varrock. Medium or hard, one of them. So, uh, I'm not doing it next, all right? Before you think to me, jump into a clip of me going, and there he's gone to tranquility. It's not happening. Later, another time. We'll see. Bully me in the comments. <laughs> all right, so you know how I said that I wasn't going to do Garden of Tranquility? Well, I'm doing Garden of Tranquility... As if I have to push this fucking statue all the way back to Varrock. This ain't anything to do with the fucking garden. This is just manual labour. What the fuck? Okay, somehow it just teleported me. So, alright, alright, it's not as bad. It's not as bad, okay. Okay, 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 calm down, calm down. Okay, right, if I speak to the old king here, and I spam through, option two, two... Oh, there's a cut. All right, I'll see you after the cut scene. Right, after a bit of a domestic, <laughs> there is Garden of Tranquility completed. We get two quest points for that one, 5k farming. We get an activated ring of Charos, Charos, whatever it is, a super compost potion, and some seeds. We get a Guam, what's that? Apple tree and an oak as well. We're up to 221 quest points, very nice indeed. That's also required for... Uh, uh, where are we? Uh, something on the Varrock one. Um, Alright, pick a white tree fruit. We need it for that. And I think there was one others, one other one on here. And... No, I think it was just that, actually. Anyway, um, we've got to do that. Oh, I can do that now. Look at me go. Oh, there we go. Medium task done. Um, and also, I need this for Swan Song, which is one quest that I want to get done as well. So, uh, two birds with the one stone gaming. Alright, so one of these uh, medium diary tasks in Varrock is picking the colour cat that I want from uh, from Gertrude. What one looks most like Midge? I mean, he's not grey, but the facial colour, you know, the different colour. I'm going to go with black. It's not it's not proper Midge. We'll, we'll have to make him fall in some Tipex <laughs> or something. Um, but yeah. There we go, there's another task completed. I've done three, three, three out of the four that we had left, so uh, let's go. Hold on, where are we? Oh, I've got two left, shit. <laughs> okay, we're back on these bloody balloons, but if I do this... I've arrived in Varrock, and that should be... Please tell me it is. Is that it? Or have I got to go the other way? Travel from Varrock. Fuck. All right, well, I've set it up. Let's go and finish it. All right, there we go. There is the medium diary done for Varrock. 
Um, I don't think we've got much more to do for the hard, if I remember correctly. Uh, 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 uh. Right, we've got 153 kudos, and that's it. That's all we need to do for the hard diary. So uh, that's a nice bit of gaming, isn't it? Right, okay, if we speak to Toby... Uh, there we go. We have uh, something about battles to... Uh, not that I'm going to bother. Anyway, we've got the uh, armor 2. What does that give us? I think there's some sort of mining buff on it, but this is what we really came here for. That succulent herb lore XP. 7.5k, lads. Doesn't give us a level, but we're 10.5 away. Not bad. There we go. Oh my god, that is the clutchiest bloody Zolra kill ever because I forgot to bring my bloody sp uh, spell book so I can't heal from th poison. So we're getting hit 20s. But we managed to get 60kc, 3 minutes 19. Not bad score on the door. Gaming. Right, when this goes down, I am... Well, actually, no, I don't need to. There we go. There's there's 61kc. Come on, give us something. Loop half key, 200 coal. Uh, yeah, uh, uh, uh. It's not the best, but it's a 3 minute 32 kill. I'll take it. I'm going to clutch it up. Come on. Clutch, 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 clutch. Oh, I'm not going to clutch. Where am I? There's only one way to find out. Am I an epic gamer? I've got one, pr I've got one bit of prayer left. Oh, he's only got a bloody done it. He's only got a bloody done it. Oh my god, the scenes. 62kc. A load of snake skin. That's a bit shit, isn't it? Bit shit. But anyway, gaming. Come on, snuff it. One more. There we go. Good night, Zora. Thank you very much for playing. Ta ta for now. See you later, mate. Thank you for the papaya tree seeds, brother. B double papaya seeds. Oh, we really do be gaming. Okay, come on. One more hit. One more hit. One more hit. Oh, I've got to run now. I've got to try and chance it with a. <laughs> chance it with a big boat! <laughs> That should do it. Bye, Zora. Palm trees. These bloody palm tree seeds. But I'd take the snapdragons. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's always just scowls in it. But 10 snapdragons, that's really nice. 64kc, decent. Okay, that should be it. Or not. Or not. There we go. There it is. There it is. Manta rays. Okay, we take those. Ad, uh, Addy bars and some scales. I mean, the manta rays are nice, but 65kc. We get, we're slowly getting that fight duration down. Oh, go on, one more hit. There we go. There is 66kc. 66, there we go. That's a slow... This rotation that it is... Uh, what is it? Rotation 3 or something? I always get a slow kill on. But, you know, it's a nice amount of death runes. It's some adamant bars. Scales, as always. Not bad. Okay. One more hit. Go on. There we go. Thank you, Snake. Thank you for being quite kind to me on this run. This was quite a nice one. New personal best. It's 301. We got some teleports. We got some flax. And we got some scales. 301. That's not a bad new personal best, if you ask me. We love to see it. We love to see it. It's not sub three minutes, but it's teetering. It is teetering. Woo! All right, and these last few orbs here are going to be... When he does it. And there we go. There is 80 crafting coming in, which unlocks... Uh, Dragonstone amulets, enhanced crystal keys, and eternal teleport crystals. Very nice. Um... Five more levels, and we can actually boost to do, uh, uh where are we? Eeeem, jewellery. Uh, we can boost to do, um, Onyx Amulets, because we can boost five. Uh, in four levels, we can boost to do the Zenite Ring, uh, which then we can enchant for the Fury and the Suffering. But, uh, yeah, we haven't got the Zenite yet, so we're probably going to go for the 85 first, because... Onyx, and then Fury, which uh, we kind of need right now for Zora and pretty much anything PVM related. And there is 76 mining coming in. Uh, back doing some sandstone mining. I'm actually wearing the Varrock um, armor 2, like the top, uh, because uh, you have a chance of mining two ores with one, uh, or two, or yeah, two ores with one rock. So uh, sometimes I'm getting two chunks of uh, rock from, uh, from mining the sandstone. But at 76 mining, that takes us to 1875 total. Um, I don't know if I, I called in the 85 million total XP, but we got that 
a while ago now, but, you know, it's a nice little milestone, isn't it? But, uh, yeah, doing some more crafting. We're uh, we're well on our way to 81, and uh, just waiting for seaweed to grow before I can make some more molten glass. But, uh, yeah, we... we <laughs> ah, we do indeed be gaming. And there is 81 crafting, four levels away from our target. But uh, what does that give us? Let's have a look. Nothing. Okay, sweet fuck all. But, uh, nah, another level. Very nice indeed. Gaming. Right, there we go. There is 68 KC and snakeskin, manta rays... Zora scales, but a 311 uh, fight duration, which isn't bad. Uh, that was better than our original uh, best uh, PB, uh, which was like 330, but uh, a few kills ago we set 301. But uh, yeah, not a bad kill, that. Right, there we go. There is 69kc and too far, uh, too far for some dragon bolt, uh, dragonstone bolt tips and Zora scales. Is that rare drop table? Who knows? Who cares? Either way. Not a bad kill. Not a bad kill. Right, there we go. There is 70 KC. Anything? Uh, snake skin, grapes, and scales. I mean, the, the grapes aren't bad. We don't get many grapes here, um, to be honest, even though the drop rate, I think, is pretty common. Uh, but we can use that for cooking, so it's not bad. Not bad. 352. 54, sorry, I can't read. Um, but yeah, 70 KC, very nice. Oh, God, I managed to clutch up on a random jad phase there, but... There are some more fucking Zora teleports. A uh, bit of a slow kill, but uh, yeah, that rotation that I got there, I'm not too au okay with uh, when it comes to speed. So uh, yeah, not the best, but not the worst. And we got the kill, which is all that matters. Right, there we go. There is 72 KC. Anything? More teleports, which is good, I guess, but uh, no uniques. And we look how much food we've got left. Holy shit. Right, there we go. There is 73 KC. Anything? Ah, <sighs> bloody toad flax seeds. <laughs> Not what you want, bruv. Right, there we go. There is 74kc. Anything? Advent bars, chaos runes, scales. Nah, a load of shit. A uh, bit of a slower kill, because it's the long rotation that I don't find that I do as much DPS on. But, uh, it's another kill, isn't it? I'm probably going to take a break from Zora, because I've only got 25 cosmics left. So I need to either make some, or buy some, but buying... As you know, you've got to buy it from Major Arena, which is a pain in the ass. Just before we get onto the roundup for this video, uh, there are actually two videos that went out on the channel this week. Uh, one was Bald Man vs. Pixel Spider, which is actually a um, stream highlight video I've taken for when I did um, a few kills at Seracnus. So go and check it out. It's actually on this account, the Dead Smithy account. Uh, so it's some side progression when we're doing some PVM. And also, I've uploaded a video of a lot of the Runelite plugins that I use. Um, so if there's any plugins that you've seen me using you want to know how i have them configured or what ones i recommend go and check out that video as well they'll all be in the description so uh go and, go and give them a watch okay right and that is going to do it for today's episode to go through our stats we are up uh blah, blah, blah. one level in mining up to 76 um three in crafting up to 81 and uh yeah we're only one up uh, four total levels in uh or four total levels. So uh, we also did a couple of quests, and we're up to 221 quest points now. And uh, we also got the Varrock Medium Diary done. Uh, we only need the Kudos for the Hard as well. So um, we're well on our way to getting that done, which is very nice indeed. Having the Varrock Armour is uh, a lot better for when we're doing sandstone mining, because we can mine a lot more quicker. Um, so it's only helping with the crafting gains. And next episode, I want to get uh, to that 85 so we can actually start boosting to be able to do the uh, Fury and also the uh, Suffering as well. Not that I've got a Zenite yet, but that's something we can start working on too. Um, but once we get the uh, Fury, it's going to be massive for Zora. Like this episode, we we got ourselves a really nice new personal best time-wise. Well, three minutes and one second. It's just shy of that sub three minute goal that I've set myself as well. Um, but it's all good progress towards the greater good. So uh, we do be gaming. But um, yeah, I'm going to stop rambling because I know this video is, uh, you know, towards the 20 minute side, which I know is quite long. But um, thank you all very much for watching. If there's anything you think I should be doing, drop them in the comment section down below. If you're not new around here, subscribe for more and also drop a like on the video. It really does help with pushing the video out in the algorithm. Um, but yeah, that being said, stay safe and I'll see you all very soon. Bye. <laughs>